Good morning, everyone. I am here in the showroom because it's pretty rainy outside. So we're going to try to get some videos in between when the rain stops. But I wanted to show you this 27 RLS hideout. It's a really awesome family friendly camper. And you know, it just checks off a lot of boxes for people. And this one in particular comes in weighing a little bit over 6,700 pounds for everything. So it's not too bad with weight. Showing you some features on the outside first, you have your powered tongue jack, and this also has a kind of utility light, so you can still access and be able to do this if it happens to be a little bit darker when you get to your campsite. Two propane tanks, and then on your front cap, you have a little bit of diamond plating lined at the bottom, so this just helps protect it when you're hauling it down the road when rocks and stuff are jumping up there, prevents the scratching. Coming to your camping side, um, you are prepped for side marker cameras, so all you have to do is just purchase the actual camera part, pop it in there, and you're good to go. Um, this just allows you to be able to view the sides of your camper while you're hauling it down the road, so that can be really nice. Right next to that is your pass-through storage. You can just stow away extra camping gear in here. Um, camping chairs, tables, things like that, beach towels, umbrellas. This also has front and rear stabilizer jacks, as well as two entrances. Your main entrance is all the way at the end, um, since you have that big helper handle. You even have a huge power awning with white LED lights. This just adds extra shade, and you can still enjoy being outside if it's raining or really, really hot. You got yourself some outside speakers. And even over here is access to your water heater, the exit point to your um, furnace. Plus you have a 110 outlet out here. So if you wanna place something on a table and be able to plug it in, you can do that. TV, blender, coffee maker, things like that. At your uh, main entrance are those solid steps that everybody loves so much. So they just fold into the camper really nicely um, and they're super sturdy. So even little pets to get in and out of the camper, um, which is great for that. All right, so coming in here directly to the left, all the way at the back is your rear living space. So this actually folds out into a sleeper sofa and you probably can sleep up to one to two people, maybe your kids, friends, just any guests staying with you. Um, end tables are on both sides for decorations. You know, you can just place your electronics there if you want. There is also an outlet on this side. Three cabinet storage up above. Plus you have this humongous window on the back. So wherever you park your camper, you have a nice view. Kind of diagonal, you have theater reclining seats. And the nice thing about this not being attached is you can kind of change the positions of them a little bit if you want. And then right across is your entertainment center. Electric fireplace down below and it is 32 inch. This will put off some heat. So if it's a chilly morning or a chilly evening, you can kick that on and it will heat up your camper. Or you can just turn it on and have the lights going, which look really, really cool. Some cubby storage up above. And then right there is your Bluetooth speaker system. So that's where you can access your outside and your inside speakers. And then of course your swivel TV some extra storage up above. And then what's behind it is really cool. You actually have a whole hidden pantry behind it. So you can stow away all of your cleaning supplies in here if you want and make it look super nice and neat here in your camper. You can just put all that stuff in here, trash cans, leashes, you know, your keys and stuff, but you have all these built-in shelves too for dry pantry goods. And you have a magnetic latch for the door, which is really, really nice. And now our booth dinette, this also will fold out into another sleeping space. Um, so this table can be folded down, put away. And if you even want to, you can probably take that table outside, have a couple chairs and stuff. This one on the left actually has some storage underneath. And the price for this unit comes out to be $28,990 for everything. And then right across is your kitchen area. So you got a huge refrigerator. You can fit lots of groceries in there. To the left is your microwave. And then just below you got your um, light plus vent fan for your stove top. And you also have three burners with a glass range cover. So you fold this up when you're ready to use your burners and it kind of prevents grease and stuff from getting all over your walls. Makes for a nice, easy cleanup. 
and there's your oven. And they each have uh, accent lights for the knobs too. They also added a safety feature so when you turn on the knobs, you can be able to tell which one is on if someone happens to bump into it. And it even works when the lights are off. So it's a really cool a safety feature they added. Storage all down below. And it even includes this road vac system. So this is a built-in vacuum inside your camper that comes with about a 30-foot nozzle. So you're able to vacuum every square inch of your camper. Um, so that's just one less thing you have to worry about. And then you have all of this countertop space for food prep. There is an outlet back there, so you can plug some small appliances in there. Stainless steel open mount sink. And then, of course, you have your spray nozzle. A couple cabinets up above. And I love that they have accent lights in there. So it kind of can be a night light for your kids, too. And coming in, you have a pass-through bathroom. So to the left is your sink. You got your storage below as well as above built-in shelf in there and right next to it you have this really tall closet just for some extra towels and washcloths and things and then directly behind me is your porcelain foot flush toilet and then all the way at the back is your shower your uh, fan is just up above but what's really nice about this is you can kind of twist it open and be able to have a little bit of natural light coming in here as well and then finally coming into our bedroom, you have a sliding barn style door um, entering in your bedroom from the bathroom. And then you have your queen size bed that does have storage underneath. You have closet lockers on both sides with really pretty mirror panels on them. Built in clothes rack. And this is actually a shelf that extends all the way across too. So extra storage or even some decorations. And then each side also has some end table, extra storage areas. Plus there are also outlets on both sides as well. And then directly to my left is a spot for an LCD mounting bracket. So you can hang a TV up here in your room. And then you have that um, extra access door right there. So that is it for this hideout, you guys. If you have any questions or concerns, please let us know and we are happy to help.